glorify the King. To my brothers in prison, keep your all head up. I do not endorse murder, rape, armed robbery, robbery, burglary, stealing, petty stuff. I don't believe in breaking the law, but I believe it's a little civil disobedience every now and again is necessary to keep the heat under the fire, to keep the heat in the fire and the fire under the feet of those who have authority over the Lord's people. And I remember the Lord's day to keep it holy. I'm not telling nobody I'm perfect. I'm telling everybody I desire to live in peace, love, and harmony with everyone that I come in contact with. This is my shrine of hope. Now I know what I never did know. I am a royal seed. I'm not afraid, ashamed or afraid to declare it. The politicians, I'm not saying they don't love this country. I'm just saying they don't love this country good enough to want to die for me or for you. Portia, challenge man. We are not poor and we are not needy in this country. We are disenfranchised. We are taken advantage of by men and women who we have entrusted our word, our mark. Now it's time for you to stop listening to these politicians and some of these church leaders, religious leaders. Not every politician is bad. Not every religious, religious leader is bad. But I say this without fear and contradiction. When one prime minister can make every post, major post in this country, as it relates to the chief justice, chief magistrate, president of the court of appeal, and all of these major posts, attorney general, if I have a problem with the government, who do I go to? Who do the people go to? And with the grace of God, we go to the Yeshua. Amen.